Aquarius, welcome back to Angels Light Tarot. Thank you, thank you, thank you for stopping by for your general message from our angels for September 16th through September the 22nd. Angels and guides, angels and guides, what is going on these seven little days? Seven little days, that's it, just seven little days. All right, Aquarius, angels and guides, angels and guides, what is going on? What is going on for Aquarius in these seven little days? Yes, yes, yes. What is going on, Aquarius, for these seven little days? Angels and guides, angels and guides, pulling out all the positive energy that we can. Yes, yes, yes. What is going on? Just a few more messages. Just a few, just a few. Just a few, that's funny. Oh my gosh, okay, so here we go, Aquarius, here we go. So, main theme, death card, reversed, rebirth. Yes, rebirth, 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 and then rebirth again. I think it's a double rebirth with a king of diamonds and the three of spades. I feel like there is a new beginning that comes out of the blue. Something starts out of the blue. I feel like it's the king of diamonds. It's you are taking control of your finances. If you're worried about it, you're worried about it. Or this could be doing something creative or doing two, two creative things at one time. But whatever it is, you are mastering your ability to get in control of your finances. I love it. I love it. I love it. Now, in the recent past, you had the, the I feel like you had the, the Ten of Wands reversed with the Six of Hearts and the Two of Clubs. In the recent past, I feel like with, as, as it pertains to your work, because I feel like this returns to you, you weren't putting in a lot of effort, okay? You knew it took a lot of work, but you're like, eh, I don't want to work. You know, eh, I'm, I'll do it when I feel like it, right? I felt like there was a bit of kind of laid back, kind of, you know, like you talked a lot about it, but you really didn't do it. You know, what, you know what I mean. Talk, 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 but you really didn't move forward in that direction. No. Now, in the middle of the week, you have the Page of Cups with the King of Hearts and the joker so basically in the middle of the week i see that you are um i feel like you're offering someone or off someone is offering you a cup of emotions um be, be weary of that cup because that cup has a fish in it so it might be a little bit fishy okay all right but but i feel that um i i'm picking up that someone is Someone is showing their emotional power, okay? Someone is definitely showing their emotional power, and I feel like it comes out of the blue. Like, you don't see it coming. Like, it might be you showing your emotional power, or it might be someone else showing their emotional power. But either way, someone I feel like is, I feel like someone is, I feel like someone is, is giving love and um, I feel like in a way that, you know, I'm giving you love um, and I'm giving you more love. I'm giving you more love. And it's like, I'm giving you this love, and you, right? <laughs> like, um, but I, I'm feeling like there's a bit of maybe not trust about the love because of the, the page, right? Like, I'm giving you love, but maybe the love that you're giving or maybe the love that you're receiving, maybe it's not at the level that you would like it to be or they would like it to be. So I feel like someone is pushing, pushing, pushing the love and I feel like it's going to create um, something unexpected. So be careful and be mindful of pushing a situation um, that isn't ready to move forward, okay? Now, in, in that manner, in that manner. I feel like I feel like things have to grow first, you know, before. Like, have that page grow into a king and, and then see, you know what I'm saying? Have, have, it, have it germinate a little bit more, if you know what I mean. Okay, now, when we when we move to the, re, the, the near future, we have the king, the king of swords, exactly, seven of spades, and the jack of hearts, so exactly. So I feel like um, in this situation, someone is being very, very stern and very, very pushy, pushy, and it's like, you know what? Here's my bottom line. Here's what I'm going to do. And I feel like it's in a in a way that's not so nice or not so pretty. It might be you. It might be someone else. And I feel like there is a sacrifice that's going to be made. 
definitely a sacrifice that's going to be made. Okay, and I feel like it's an emotional department. It might be with your children, it might be with your partner, it might be with a family member, but definitely, um, I feel like a pullback. I feel like there's a pullback here. Now, um, the, the bonus is the Eight of Swords. The Eight of Swords is reversed with the Six of Wands. The Judgment is reversed. The Two of Wands is reversed. Joker and the Three of Diamonds. So I feel like what... I feel like if you were stuck in a situation, you felt mentally you were bound to a situation. Well, this week, I feel like you're going to feel like, nah, not so much. Yeah, like, yeah, no, right? I feel like you, you, you've you seen things in a different light and you're. I feel like you're ready to move in a direction where you are definitely celebrated. And the judgment, I feel like it's not judgment. It's not about the gong or the, 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 the universe saying blah, 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 blah. No, it's you making that decision. Absolutely with the was right okay so the two of swords is like yes you are making the decision it's not the universe it's you are making this decision and I feel like this decision is coming from out of nowhere and you people are like what you made what decision and I feel like this three of diamonds is like something creative something worrisome I feel like I feel like people are worried about the decision that you are making um Yeah, I feel like people are worried about the decision that you're making. Um, I, I, I just feel like, um, you know, with the situation, you can pull back, you know, release some of this energy into whatever this, this uh, emotional situation is. You can pull back a little bit and... Um, you can, but I don't see that happening because of the, the King of Swords. I see someone being very, very aggressive in a way of, um, you know what, I'm going to make this happen no matter what. Now, the Seven of Spades is also spiritual. So now the King of Swords can also say, you know what, yes, this is the way it's going to be. And I'm going to be non-attached to the situation. I'm not going to pour everything into it. I'm not going to push. I'm not going to do, I'm just going to release and being in that release, I'm making a sacrifice, right? I'm making a sacrifice to release the situation. Now, and I, I feel like because someone hasn't proven themselves, that's what I feel like, someone hasn't proven themselves. And and now that you see that, that, okay, now I see what this truly is, now you're ready to go into a direction where you are celebrated, and it's, it's not a matter of the universe is saying do this, do that, it's a matter of you deciding, and you have made up your mind, and it's shocking people, and but they're still worried. Okay, so I send you joy, namaste, and much, much love sent your way.